percent as well. Dr. Dogre, MD and CEO of the company, John, joins me right now on the show. Good having you, Mr. Dogre. Thanks for joining in. Uh, explain, uh, take us to the quarter, really. I mean, Thank profits you. have grown by six percent uh, in line with what the top line growth has been. Is this something that is seasonal, and are you happy with the quarter, or would you have hoped for more, really? Yeah, I think uh, we have been in view of the uh, the economic uh, uh, scene as of now. I think we have to take this number as uh, you know good numbers. Though uh, during the half year ended September 2013, our total income grew by eight percent, and uh, the EBITDA also was higher, were around 17 percent, 16.9 percent exactly. Uh, during the half year, though, as you are saying, Q2, we grew around 6.3% uh, uh, on the total income and EBITDA grew around 5%, net profit grew by 6%. Uh, and I think we have already declared a second interim dividend of rupees 6 per share, uh, thus by maintaining a uh, dividend payout uh, of around 68%. And I think uh, we have to take these numbers as uh, good. Uh, we have been able to maintain our uh, uh, operating margins at 17, 71.7% during this uh, quarter. Uh, I think that's a, that's a uh, good kind of number. So how do you expect the second half to be? Would there be a 5 to 10% kind of growth in Q3 and Q4? Or would you expect better performance, both top line and bottom line? See, for, yeah, for rating industry, since a mature rating company would be doing 50 to 60 percent of its, uh, 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 I'm sorry, 50 to 60 percent, you know, income comes out of surveillances. And Q2 and Q3 are uh, the two quarters where most of the surveillance are done because audit results come to you in your hand somewhere in the month of July, August, September, October. Uh, you know, that's a time when you complete most of the surveillance. So, mm. oops, okay. We'll try and uh, get that. But he mentioned, I think, that they'll do 50 or 60 percent of their revenues going ahead. Uh, Fair call, Mr. Dogre. Leave it at that. Thanks so much for joining in today and giving us that perspective. That's DR Dogre, MD and CEO of CARE, speaking about how the quarter ahead would be. Slew of earnings slated to come out. Let's start off. Uh, 